Hello, Carl here with Sustainability Theory News. We're over at WashingtonPost.com, and they have an article, Is Organic Agriculture Really Better for the Environment? And they have a lot of great points here. They're talking about uh, Michael Cavagelli, I believe his name is. He's a researcher, yeah. Cavagelli right here with the USDA, who have been running what they're calling Organic versus Conventional Smackdown. Um, so basically, well, it's been running since 1993. They've been testing two conventional farming operations and three organic farming operations first thing they'll say not all conventional are the same not all organic are the same and here are the verdicts of the test organic systems have more fertile soil use less fertilizer and herbicide use less energy they lock away more carbon in the soil and they're more profitable for the farmers the conventional systems they have higher yields of course less profitable yields and they're better at reducing erosion, but only when they use no-till systems. So that is very interesting because no-till is somewhat permaculture organic movement. So a combination of conventional and organic could work out well. And the author of this article also goes into it about uh, how they should stop working with this dichotomy of organic versus conventional and start looking for a solution to take the best of both worlds. And... They uh, also say that it's great that organic produce is grown because it's people voting with their dollars. It's a vo chance for people to vote no on food they don't like. So I'd suggest checking out more. If you want to read more about it, check the link in the description. And if you'd like to see more news headlines like this, subscribe to my channel. Have a great day.